Good morning! All right, day two, and just getting ready to start my day. It's like 12.30, yeah, I know. But I've been hanging out and doing my thing all morning, and I have to be off this site by one o'clock, so working on getting out of here. But first of all, I just have to take this thing great idea totally flat did not sleep so a little sore feeling kind of old today but it's gonna be all right so anyway peace out guys i'm gonna tear this down and move on to site number two and we're back and there we have it so on to the next site. It's been real, it's been fun. X marks the spot. Just take a moment. I think this is by far one of my favorite spots in this whole park. Campsite number 69, we will be back. Time out for a minute because I seriously have friends. Oh, oh, there he goes. See? I don't know where I went, but it was just my tent. All right, here we are at campsite number two, which is actually campsite number one. Hammock. Is all set up and ready to go. Even have my own little private bathroom back there, which I'm sure is a porta potty. Tent. Got my own little door. We set up the big guy today. And inside we have our gear bag, pillow, trying a little bit different of a sleeping arrangement tonight. Light. And we go outside and we turn to our handy dandy fire pit that we're gonna have a good bonfire at later. So, I am super happy with this site and really excited because I'll show you. If you look straight in front of me, I have nothing but park the store and water. That is where I will be heading later. Pretty awesome. All right, we are off to Jay's to get things we need for this to cook. And then we're gonna go find some elk. So here we go. Seriously, like the tunnel of trees right now. You gotta see this. Although I'm about out of it, so hold on. See behind me? Tunnel of trees. Tunnel of 
Crazy, but super cool. So it looks like behind me is their viewing area number two and it is a big open field. Honestly, I think any hunter would love to just pop a deer stand up somewhere in here and call it good, but there's no elk. So we're gonna hang tight for a little bit and uh, go on to the next spot after a few minutes. We'll wait and see if anything comes out. Okay, we're in reverse because this is one of the creepiest things I have ever seen. So give me a minute and I will show you. Um, literally just drove by this. So, um, for the record, I'm also very lost. So now I'm really getting out of here. <laughs> 